Previously on Game Trip. Get to Saffron City here. That, that's it. And then we beat Giovanni, and that'll be easy, because he's a pushover. Oh, is it going to be a thirsty guard thing? How do I get water for these jerks? Where would I just get some water? I mean, it, it's everywhere. Maybe there will be some trainer battles, which will allow me to experience some trainer battles. Oh, Tail Whip, Mega Dan. That's a move, I guess. You throw your fish down. I throw my rhinoceros next to it, and we say, what'll happen? What'll happen between fish and rhinoceros? Share this with the other guards. Well, they're all going to share that one water bottle. Welcome back to Game Trip. We're in front of the gym in Saffron City. This this jerk is in the way, and he's like, get out of the way. And I'm like, you get out of the way, and nothing happens. It's when an unstoppable uh, object meets an immovable force. Um, and we're... I, I can go in this building, though, and I imagine I'm just going to fight these guys. So I'm all, I'm all geared up. I'm all prepped up. We're almost finished with Pokemon Yellow. Uh, it's like, I don't know, it's probably like five episodes, like, we'll, we'll be done. And then maybe we can go get Mewtwo, because that's, that's like the extra dungeon, you know, over by Cerulean City, I think, because that guy wouldn't let me in there. So here we go, Fighting Gym, Muscly types, Big Bulgy types. Uh, Kangas Dan was probably a poor choice, because he's regular type. Just... <laughs> Just not normal, just regular. They're regular. All the Pokemon in, in his type group use the restroom, you know, like twice a day on the clock. You know, never miss a beat. It's a, it's a regular type. This is going really well. What level are these guys? No, they're the right level. I'm just... Look at him. It looks like his hands, Primate, his hands look like boxing gloves, but those are his hands. They're just weird-shaped hands. They're like little mittens. It's gonna be weird. Imagine if all your fingers were just tied together. I didn't even read what he said. I'm sure it was something muscly and karate. Karate. He was like, Cobra Kai, fight. Let's, uh, let's change it up and do some punches at him. Well, if I can just keep one-shotting these guys, I, I don't I don't think this will be a problem. So, I'm... I don't know. I think it's day two now of no, no nicotine. And today is the day where I really had no nicotine. And uh, it's been a long time. I've had a bunch of attempts to quit cigarettes, and I could go and... I mean, I got time. Why not go into that whole freaking thing? You know, there's a lot of time to kill in between killing Pokemon is all I'm trying to say. Judge, one point. No, two points. I beat this guy, too. Our master is a pro fighter. I would, I would hope so. Nothing tough frightens me. <laughs> Only soft things frighten me. But anyway, I had this neighbor who turned out to be kind of racist later, I found out. Um, which is crazy. But they gave me some pipe tobacco one time. And, you know, I, I, I smoked weed. And I wasn't afraid of a little bit of nicotine. You know, I'd, I'd had a, I've had a hit or two off a cigarette occasionally, but it wasn't my thing. You know, the all the, all the advertising not to smoke in elementary school, it worked. I'd never smoked throughout school, anything. I was even afraid to smoke pot. I wouldn't smoke anything. Wow, I'm almost here. Whore, take off your shoes. What? You're... <laughs> He's called me a whore. Anyway, um... I wouldn't smoke uh, anything. And then this, this neighbor, you know, he made it fancy for me, which was the mistake. And it was just some pipe tobacco. And I'm like, oh, what's wrong with smoking some pipe tobacco? So we started drinking, you know, and 
smoking of the pipe tobacco, and I started to feel really good off that pipe tobacco. And I had a great night, you know, just smoking that stuff and drinking it. So I decided to get, you know, a little bag of my own, and I'll be like, okay, well, I'll just have this pipe tobacco on occasion. It's not like it's even super addicting or anything. Wrong. Pipe tobacco can totally get you hooked. Um, and it just... You know, what it really did was my art was getting better. I was doing art back then, and I, and I still do art, just, you know, on and off. But I actually have a deviant art. I could, I could link that somewhere. Anyway, but um, it would make me concentrate, and I've always had a hard time concentrating because I have ADHD, you know? So the instant ability to just concentrate from the nicotine was so, so great that I just kept doing it, and then, you know, when, when I lost some, some money and I was poor, I'm like, okay, well, you know, I, I can just buy some loose leaf tobacco and smoke that out of a corn cob pipe, and I was doing that, now, which is essentially cigarettes, you know, and then I was, I, I started smoking black and miles all the time, and you don't even want to be part of that, don't, nobody should do that, they're the worst, it's, it's like smoking a, the cardboard your pizza comes in. And Kangaskhan is Kangas Dan and uh, never mind. I spoke too soon. He's dead. We shall we shall we shall miss him. You know what? Qualiger, get out there. You need to level up. You with your no no electric attacks. Nice. Anyway, and then I was I was working on this this pot farm uh, with this guy, and he, he smoked menthols, you know. And uh, I eventually started sharing them with him. And then, you know, I was buying my own packs and and stuff after that. And it's all downhill from there, you know. Um, I wasn't as bad as some people. I think the worst I ever was was like half a pack a day. You know, I hear some people smoking like two packs a day, and I'm like, holy crap! Like, do you have, when do you have time to do anything else? You probably don't. It is kind of overwhelming. Um, it's, it's something I'm not going to miss, but this really feels like the time that I'm, I'm really quitting. I don't even feel that bad. I'm just, I'm a little lost and grumpy and cold and depressed, I guess, most of the time. But look at me, I'm doing my YouTube show at least. I can't be that, I'm not like freaking out that hard. Ooh, but my throat is dry. Since I stopped, there's been this dryness in my throat. But I beseech you, do not take our emblem as your trophy. In return, I will give you a prized fighting Pokemon. Choose whichever you like. Oh, I'm all about Hitmonlee. He's got those stretchy feet. Yes! Yes! Oh, man. I'm gonna call him... Dr. Foot. He's a foot doctor, but also a, a martial artist. Oh, wait, doctor... He has a PhD. Dr. Foot. Um, with a Pokemon on the end. Pokemon. There we go. Dr. Foot Pokemon. There was no room for Pokemon. Dr. Foot Pokemon was <laughs> sent to Pokemon Box. Ah. <coughs> uh, and let's just take that other one, too. Better not get greedy. Okay, fine. Ho! Whoa! That last guy called me a whore. This guy called me a hoe. I'm getting out of here. Was that not the gym? Is this actually the gym? And I just didn't... I didn't actually... I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but there's another building in this town which needs my attention, so... We're gonna heal up the good old Pokemon and head over to the Team Rocket owned building, because as you can see, they're kind of just roaming the streets here like they own the place. It's kind of creepy. Reminds me of a lot of places in, uh... Oh, Wyoming. I drove through Wyoming once, and... 
you ever if you ever saw that movie with Daniel Day Lewis, um, and Winona Ryder, uh, oh, I always forget the name of it. Sing, 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 sing. Well, anyway, it's a movie. It's it's about the Salem witch trials, and that movie reminds me of every town I've ever been to in Wyoming. It's just weirdly dark, religious, and and quiet. It's very quiet, which is, ooh, ooh, that that really dropped. This tune's a banger. Oh yeah, look at this crap. There's all sorts of crap going on here. You know there is. And it's got a checkered floor, which usually means Team Rocket's here. Whoa! That's a lot of floors. Well, I guess it would make sense to start on two. This is going to be crazy. Am, is there Pokemon everywhere, or is it... Uh-oh, so we got teleporters... Well, doesn't hurt to go just go through a teleporter sometimes. Okay, that guy's gonna want to fight me. Well, I should fight all the guys I can because who know who who might have a key? See, he's one of the four Rocket Brothers. Whoa, who are they? A wheezing. This one must be James, but he's not a brother. Alright, uh, do your strength, because that seems to kill everything for some reason. Oh, Golbat. The Zubat family is close to my heart, except for Zubat. I fucking hate Zubat. There's too many Zubats. <coughs> Ugh. Sorry, guys. Quitting smoking has... I don't know, my throat's like going through some kind of transformation or something. Or I'm just dry and coughing all the time. Which, good lord, I'm, try I'm trying to do a YouTube show that I just started and I've been attacked by, like, COVID and throat disease and now this thing. And it's just, like, someone chop off my arm or something. I don't need that to record. I need my, my throat and my lungs and... And all that stuff. Wait, wait, wait. I missed what this brother said. I'll leave you up to my brothers. Okay. But did you see how strong I was? Do you think that maybe that they don't stand a chance against me? Okay, I don't know. Empty rooms. Paths that go no nowhere. Doors that open into walls. That's as far as you'll go. How about you? Because I know for a fact, for the rest of the game, you're going to stay exactly right here. In fact, you may go back a few steps. Oh, man. You know what happened? Not that I'm going to get super political on this show at all, but they, uh, they ousted Tucker Carlson out of Fox News. Which, I mean, I'm not even going to begin to speculate on why that happened, but it's so surprising. But also, I hate him, and he's gone now. I mean, he's not gone, you know? It's like, it's like, I don't know. It's just, it's it's weird times. I was weirded out when, when Bill O'Reilly, like, got ousted out of Fox News, because... I grew up with him on in the in the car. We had Bill O'Reilly on in the car. We had him on at home, you know, whenever his show was on. And I didn't know anything about politics back then. I had no opinions, you know. It was just the old man that my dad watched on TV. And he was really angry, and I didn't like how angry he was. You know, it just, like, I was like, man, this angry guy, and he's making my dad angry, too. You know, and I feel like Tucker Carlson's that guy, just making people mad. You know, just stirring up, like... And it, it, sometimes it's good, like, sometimes the anger needs to be. There's nothing wrong with anger, but generating it in such excess all the time, it's it's just no way to, to present ourselves as humans. I don't know. That's my opinion. So, I'm, I'm getting off the soapbox. Here we go. All right, I'm back on the floor with Voltorb. Oh, 
Oh, King is Dan. No, ah. Oh. Now her ears hurt. Had some of the worst tinnitus of my life the other day, too. Like, I, it, it sounded like, I don't know, like, it sounded like a flash bang grenade from Call of Duty or something. You know, that sound where it's just like everything goes deaf and then you hear that ring. It was crazy. I don't know why that happens to me. Magneton! He's a ton of magnets. Yuck, 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 yuck. Three guys stuck together. Great idea. Kangastan, yeah! He's trying to learn Leer. Why are we learning these basic ass Pokemon moves? Uh. I don't know. I'm not really using Comet Punch. I guess it would be more useful to have something I could weaken with. But why? Why are we learning these old ass moves? Okay, let's um let's take a back seat here. We're going to put Mega Dan up front because I really want him to evolve and I don't know what level it happens at. And you you're one of the brothers, aren't you? No, he's not. He's not a brother. Harbok. Do your skull bash. Oh, you're so screwed, Arbok. Okay, now just now just stomp on his face. And that's how you kill a snake with a rhino. It's not smart to pick fights with Team Rocket. I'm not, I just, I'm, I'm a kid and I'm just lost in here. That's my alibi. Ah, Christ. And we don't need, we don't need Payday. I don't, I can't foresee why I would use Payday. You know what, Pikachu, fine. Well, I need all those moves. Oh, Christ. No. Yes. And then we can just toss it. Because I can't, I can't, I have to take this item. I can't even move unless I do. Oh, yeah. Well, that seems really, really useful. Card key probably goes in the card door. Well, I don't know. I have no idea. Rocket wants to fight. Oh, not Team Rocket. He's just Rocket. And he's just got one really, really nosy Hypno. Stomp him. Stomp him. Ah, uh, headbutt. You can't headbutt a Rhyhorn. He's covered in horns and armor, and you'll hurt your head. Oh no. Oh no, he's sick. Oh, Mega Dance evolving! Oh, well, I thought it was like level 55, but no, here it goes. Here it goes. Here it goes. <coughs> oh, sick. Right on, so cool. I'm an angry rhino. Blah. Which reminds me, coughing evolves into wheezing. <laughs> Did he talk about evolution because my Pokemon evolved? That doesn't seem likely. Hmm. Oh good, does it just open all the doors? That gives me so much access now. Okay, what else am I throwing away? Well, I don't really need the town map. Oh, well, I guess I can't. What about that? No, okay, well, not the silph scope, maybe. Nope, no, can't throw that away. Uh, how about... Egg Bomb? I don't really have an egg Pokemon. Uh, 
Another one. Let's see what this one does. TM09. Take down. Yes. How about you, Mega Dan? You need a move. Um, let's see. I don't really need Fury Attack. Ooh, I wish I still had Horn Drill, though. <coughs> mm. The dryness of my throat. Good, good golly, Miss Molly. Ha, <laughs> it's so satisfying. This guy looks like some kind of brother. Hey, brother. I work for Sylph. What should I do? Oh. Hey, brother. He's not a brother. This is a fun dungeon, though. I, I don't run into Pokemon constantly, which makes it a little funner than that last one that I kept getting lost in. Wow, I can't, I cannot even tell what I'm looking at with him in front of me like that. Okay, takedown does do some recoil. Um, let's see, 42. You know what? I'm neglecting Charizard a little bit. Let's send Charizard out to fire blast some things, because if Pokemon's about anything for me, it's about fire blasting things with Charizard. You know, the, the, the thing about Pokemon where it really got me as a kid, like where it really got in my imagination, is I really, like, would imagine what it would be like to have, like, a Charmander. You know, not the cartoon version. I would, like, picture, like, a real Charmander, and he would hang out with me and uh, set everything I wanted on fire. And I thought that was great. You know, I mean, as a kid, now, now it seems, like, kind of egotistical and destructive, but, you know, it... It made it's fun. It would be fun to have a Pokemon. I don't think anyone could argue that. Like just an animal that is like a, a freak element, elemental incarnation that loves you for no reason. That would be super great. Oh, hello, sir. I support Team Rocket more than I support Sylph. <coughs> traitor! Traitor! Burn the Pokemon traitor! Oh, Mega Dan, I gotta, I gotta put you in the back seat. You are evolved now. You're a god. You're Rhydon. You're the hardest Pokemon. You're so hard. Hard as a rock. Hard as Mount Rushmore. The hard parts of, of Mount Rushmore. Take down. Damage yourself. Ah. Wow, he is just a tank. Oh no, he got poisoned. I, I got full heals out the wazoo, though. Yeah, really got me now. You got me so I don't want to turn I forgot the lyrics mid, mid sentence. All right, let's switch you out. Lord Love, get in front. Oh, wait, Qualiger, though. Qualiger's got to level up into some electric moves and, and, and fast. Oh, but we can, we can cure. What's his name? It's nice when you buy things for your Pokemon. Your Pokemon seem to adore you, kid. What an astute observation, Team Bronket. Perhaps you could learn something. What is Drowsy? Supposed to be some kind of anteater? Because Hypno just looks like a weird man. Just a weird man. Okay, let's see. How's this quick attack working out for you, Qualiger? You're not a normal type anymore, so it doesn't do as much damage. Oh, no, we're confused now. Either way, you're going to hurt yourself. It's 
Still taking names, Qualiger. I was playing Fire or Radical Red the other day, and there's I saw that there's a new form of Grimer with like a yellow a yellow mouth. And I haven't seen the muck that it evolves into yet, but that is super cool. I have a little Gengar that I got from Build a Bear because a friend of mine, actually Erica, from uh, one of our shows we're gonna do, worked at Build a Bear and gave me a Gengar, and he also has a suit. He has like a full like, you know, pinstripe suit, and it's it's sexy as hell, and I love the Gengar. But he's a terrible pillow, you know, and we joke that he eats our dreams because, you know. It, we, we always wake up feeling like crap if we sleep on Gengar as a pillow. Okay, T it looks like it's time for some R&D. Let's heal these guys up. There we go. And one for you, Mega Dan, just in case. He has so much life, he's so strong. Oh wait, you got advice? <coughs> Oh, did I get to that guy? Made him reminisce about the old days when he wasn't a criminal. Didn't live this life of constant fear. There's nothing here! Oh, look! Oh, did I really just do some R&D? Just to have somebody here to give me some beds? Nah, he was going to get me no matter what. Oh, and I got to fight them all because he's one of the four brothers. One of the four rocket brothers. Curly, Jurly, Murly, and Furly. And, uh, and Reginald. He's the fifth brother that I don't have to fight because they don't... Reginald just stays home. He's embarrassing. That was somewhat confusing. Learn an electric move. Let's do it. No, not this time. And we'll just... Keep up with the double edge, because that's the fastest way to kill Team Rocket. I mean, it's worth it, because he's just going to hit me anyway. No, not my bite. The one move that I wasn't using at all. Great! They're dead! That's two brothers down, two brothers to go. My brothers will avenge me. That's what the last brother said, but I'll just kill them like I killed you. Well, this card key... I don't know if I was supposed to find it this fast. It has given me unlimited access to this whole building. Exploiting the weak spots does work. Think about element types. Oh, wow, the music, like, changed when I talked to him. I thought I was going to have to fight him. But it seems that that is not, not the case at all. Have I already been in this room? Yeah. Yeah, I have. What about here? Protein! That one is attack, so... Who needs physical attack? That would be... King Dostan. Being the elemental type that he is. Nyam, 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 nyam. What about you? Are you gonna fight me? It's kind of random who's gonna fight me. Some of these scientists are my friends, some aren't. It, it represents some sort of inter-workplace scuffle that was probably going on.
Oh, Qualiger. We, we got hyper potions for you. Don't worry. Oh, crap. We're almost out of time. I knew I was running stuff at, to talk... At, I was running out of stuff to talk about. That's why my episodes are 30 minutes sometimes. Just run out of things to say. But we'll finish this guy off. And then... I knew this this one's gonna be like a two dun episode dungeon. No, there's a there's a third edge. The third edge is that it might miss. Uh oh, uh oh. That's not a good way to treat your Pokemon. That was a lesson to you all. Um, yeah, let's get Charizard out to finish it up. Uh, fire Blast. Oh, really? How about a Fire Blast? <laughs> it doesn't matter what you are. We worked on the ultimate Pokeball, which would catch anything. Ah, this is where I'm going to get the Master Ball. Okay, well, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll call it this time. Um, wait, 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 what's this? It's a Pokemon report. Four Pokemon evolve only when traded by Link Cable. It's a Pokemon report. Over 160 Pokemon techniques have been confirmed. It's a Pokemon tutorial. It's a Pokemon report. Pokemon Lab created Porygon, the first virtual reality Pokemon, who's virtually in reality, but also virtually real. Anyway, okay, next time on Game Trip, we'll finish up this dungeon. Yeah. <laughs>